at these boots, you guys. Oh my gosh. Welcome to my channel. If you have not subscribed, please do so and hit that notification bell so you know each time I upload a new video. Okay. You already know that I am unboxing my Prada monolith boots. I am so excited. I have been waiting for them to arrive. Honestly, I ordered them in May so I could wear them this winter, but it didn't turn out that way. But I really just wanted to unbox this with you so I didn't fiddle with the box or anything like that. So I am so excited to share this moment with you. I have the box right here. Let me get it. As you can see, this box is huge, okay? Because these boots are not small. They were not cheap either, okay? So <laughs> let's just open the box. Stuffing. Look at this, you guys. <laughs> Isn't it so fancy? It's quite heavy. So I'll put it back down and we can open it together. So it just says Prada Milano 1913, whatever. Okay. Oh, so this is it inside. We've got an envelope here that we're going to read. Okay. Wow. I love this blue. Let's see what's inside. Okay. What could this be? Right. This looks like the Prada return instructions right there. And we have the packing list. So yes. And that was that. Oh my goodness. Oh. You know a store is fancy because they have their own tissue paper that they use with Prada on it. Like Prada. <gasps> okay. at this oh my gosh and those famous pouches that the boots come with and sis Prada here oh my goodness this is the other one okay all right why did I buy these boots, okay? They were the it, okay? Online, Instagram, YouTube, everywhere. And when I first saw them, I said, oh my gosh, I have to have them, <laughs> okay? And then I started picturing my life with them and I couldn't move past living my, the rest of my life without these boots. Like, I just thought life itself will be bland without them. I just saw my whole life 
swagged up in these. What happened was they were sold out everywhere and on the Prada website, um, luckily for me, there were only two sizes left. There was a six and a 6.5, I believe. And I chose the 6.5. Typically, I am a seven in shoes, but I heard these shoes run big. So I felt, you know, okay with ordering half a size down. I have not tried them on and I will, um, but I just wanted to do this unboxing with you. One day you might see me style them, you know, um, how I'll wear them and so on. But I'm so excited. I'm thinking of like a um, oversized dress, like a short dress um, with these boots or, listen, half my wardrobe, I can think of many things I could wear with these boots. I'm pretty sure they're leather. Otherwise, I probably would not have paid that much. Let me check how much they were again. I had to quickly log into my email. Um, okay, so monolith leather boots. Um, price was 2,430 Australian dollars. This is the size 37 and in the black color, um, zero shipping cloth. Yeah, that's it there. I mean, was this a wise purchase? <laughs> Who knows? Okay, you do what you gotta do <laughs> to look good and to feel good, okay? So let's just take a closer look at these boots, okay? Um, they have laces all the way up. And they have these two pouches and the pouches just have the silver zip with Prada written on there. And I will unzip them in a minute. And they have, they're just on this belt, this leather belt here buckled. That's it there. Empty. That's one. And I took off and clips there. And as you can see, it has that buckle. And so yes, let us, I don't know how exactly you're supposed to wear them because you got the zip. Okay, I think I have to take this buckle off. That way I can unzip, oh, okay. Anyway, I really like the fact that they have these tags um, with the name on there, the brand name. This part kind of reminds me of like off-white and um, you know how the other stores put like a tag on there. So I'll just unzip and then wear it or I will not be doing all these laces each time I have to wear the boots. That just looks like too much work. But let's have a look under here. Ooh, this looks like a tire, a car tire. You guys, this is quite heavy, especially the bottom part. Like it's not heavy where I won't be able to walk, but you can tell this is some craftsmanship, okay? Um, I mean, you are paying for luxury. Mm, it has that new leather smell, you know what I mean? It's more bearable than like being in a new car because a new car can like smell too new and oh it smells good and it says Prada down there anyway that's them my Prada monolith boots I also mentioned them in my wish list uh, luxury wish list video which I will link in the description box so make sure you watch that one so you see other goodies that I might unbox the zips are very like steady, like heavy. Um, they say Prada Milano on there. Okay. And inside, <gasps> they say Prada. Actually, very, very good. 
Um, all right, so I guess I'll just slip my foot in here and that's it there. It's starting to look, you know, to get tiny wrinkles because this is leather. So they are going to get wrinkly, but that means they'll be super comfortable because my feet are very sensitive. I bruise easily in shoes. So quality leather or soft leather, uh, real leather should um, help me not get bruised easily. So I don't think I will be undoing these laces. I will just be using the zip. Um, it has this number here and it says made in Italy right there. And of course it says Prada here. So when you're wearing them, it'll show that it's Prada. I am so excited you guys to wear these. I just know that they're going to grab attention. Um, but anytime I want to be understated, I will take the pouches off and just wear them without the pouches because I know I can do that. I'll probably just wear them buckled and like this without the pouches on some occasions. So just leave me a comment below. Let me know if you have these boots and, or if you have other boots that are similar. I know Prada makes similar boots with like um, a different heel um, that are like ankle boots. Um, and I know like Zara and all them, they do like copies of this shoe. So let me know if you've tried any of them, but for me, I just really wanted the real thing, the real deal, you know, and give it a go. Um, hopefully, I can remember to come back and show you how I wear them. Let me know in the comment section if that's really something that you want to see. Um, me styling my clothes and my shoes and the things that I show you. I even saw that some celebrities wore these like um, Bella Hadid, Rihanna and a few others and they looked so good on them thank you so much for watching i hope you enjoyed this video if you did like it and leave me a comment in the comment section i will see you in my next video bye